Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Jenny's ice cream. These were $6.99 each at Jungle Gems International Market in Ohio. I have the Boozy Eggnog. And I have the Cognac with gingerbread. So, Boozy Eggnog is egg custard spiked with nutmeg and Middle West Spirits Whiskey. That's the brand, Middle West Spirits Whiskey. Velvety texture and flavor with notes of vanilla and caramel. Um, see, it says distributed by Jenny's Ice Cream in Columbus, Ohio. I had no idea. We have never tried Jenny's uh, ice creams, so uh, we bought a lot to try at Jungle Gems International oh, Market. Good. <laughs> and these are that we I decided to try these first because these were out for the holiday season, and they still had plenty of them left. But I figured this would be a good place to start. Two thirds cup, 124 grams is 340 calories per serving, or if you eat this entire uh, container, it's 1,020. It says, my grandfather always spiked his eggnog with whiskey. It's the Midwestern way, and I wouldn't go a holiday without it. Our friends at Middle West Spirits in Columbus, Ohio, blend a non-traditional winter wheat bourbon whiskey just for us. One that's soft on the palate with a little spice and a clean finish, which folds beautifully into cream. And of course, there is some fresh nutmeg blooming in this egg-based silken custard. I'd serve this in a pretty cordial glass with a spoon of whipped cream, a sprinkle of extra nutmeg, and a ginger cookie. You could do a nice whiskey on the side there too. The perfect finish to a winter dinner, Jenny. It's grass grazed milk. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, six. I think you just grab and pull. Okay, we have had this sitting out for what ten minutes, probably. Yeah. Okay. But you don't necessarily have to. It looks like it's soft enough. To yeah, work. I just did it so that it would be easier for us to get into. So we're fighting with it. Yeah, let me. And this, um, it looks. Uh, it looks like a um, like a vanilla bean. The reason I say that is because it has the little pieces in it. I'm sure that's the nutmeg. I used to just eat it out of the container, so. Unless it's something we may not keep. That's very good. Very, very creamy. Yes. Yeah, it's not as eggnoggy as you would expect. But it's probably because the whiskey's in there. That's what I think. We've had that. other ice creams that were just eggnog, and it's a pure eggnog flavor. I tell you what, though, I really like the addition mm -hmm. of the whiskey. Oh, it's um, very good. We, uh, Kevin, and I never drink spiked eggnog. We, you know, we just drink the regular eggnog out of the container. Um, that is very good. Mm -hmm. that is Delicious. Good. Um, I, I will never turn down the eggnog. <laughs> um, I don't care what it's got in it. <laughs> it's incredibly creamy. And, yeah, um, it's good quality ice cream. Yes, and it's already melting in the bowl, which tells you something, too. That uh, That is delicious. Yeah, so if all, the, if all the genies that we bought are like that, I'll be happy. I know. Uh, me, too. This is the cognac with gingerbread, warming cognac ice cream with notes of butterscotch and brown sugar dark caramel sauce, and heavily spiced gingerbread cake pieces throughout. It sounds fantastic. Um, for a fundraiser one year, I got to prepare dessert with Lynn Rosetto Casper. I don't know who that is. Uh, using the darkest molasses I could find. I made the gingerbread cake from her book, The Splendid Table. I topped this perfect cake, the inspiration for the molasses, brown sugar and ginger spiced version we make and fold into this flavor with cognac ice cream and praline sauce. A spark would have set the place ablaze with all that cognac, but everyone went crazy for it. Swanky and indulgent with complex French brandy on the nose and nutty caramel sauce, this ice cream is one of my longtime holiday favorites. Two thirds cup, 124 grams is 350 calories or 1,050 calories for the entire container. Yeah, it's probably on par with Bob and Jerry's and stuff, isn't it? What? The calories. Yes, the calories per container, yes. Ooh. I do like the seal it has in there, too. I do, too. Yes. 
We don't waste the stuff on the top oh. ever. Okay, this, oh wow, this looks so good. It looks like, it, it's like full of stuff. Yeah. And I don't want you to. No, you take whatever you got to, because I don't want to drip on the table when I hold it up. Okay, it is like, even after I went down in there, there still is tons of stuff. But those go fall off. And I mean, there is a huge glob of, look at the caramel. My yeah. goodness. Oh, my caramel. I'm assuming instead of chocolate, those are gingerbread pieces. Mm-hmm. You can taste the cognac. Yeah, I don't know if that's a good thing. Yeah, I think I some people say eating. cognac. I could get used to eating them. Cognac, cognac. Uh, that is delicious. I love that. I could gobble that up, the whole bowl. I like the eggnog better. I don't. I like that one better. <laughs> this one has a lot more going on, that's for sure. It does. Um, but I like a simple ice cream. I'm, I'm the kind of guy that likes just vanilla, though. So, I mean... Kevin and my aunt, both of them, uh, could sit on the couch um, and just eat the vanilla. I love vanilla. Um, I do like it. Um, the, the first bite of cognac was pretty strong. Um, but after that, when I took a second bite, I was like, oh, yeah, that blends really nicely. So, oh, I love it. It's it's a good. I love the um, the 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 gingerbread pieces. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, good texture. Because they're not chewy, but they're not crispy. It's it's like having like hunks of like cake in there. Mm -hmm. And then um, the caramel and caramel's really good and sweet. I love it. It's it's creamy even with all that going on. There still is a creaminess to it. Mm -hmm. um, and believe it or not, and I said I would never turn down an eggnog, and I still wouldn't, but I, out of the two, I would choose that, that gingerbread. Yeah, and I, would I love it. it. It is absolutely delicious. So, these, I'm glad I started with these, because like I said, these are the first Jenny's ice cream that we've tried, and they are absolutely delicious. So, this uh, this will be fun, trying all the ones that, that we got. So, hopefully, you all will be interested in them. And uh, we'll be trying them soon. And I'll have a picture for you at the end. And thanks for watching.